And, well, what have I got fucking next for you guys? Another fucking product for the hair. Me and hair have gone off on one this time. We're doing so many bloody videos. I'm buying so many fucking products. I'm grabbing the shop. I'm grabbing anything I can get. I just grab it all in the fucking, grab it in the basket and run to the tail and go, I want it all now. So, uh, I was on YouTube and, well, we're on it now. Well, well, well. I saw this advert for this guy and he was like my hair and he was like this. All modelling, all this dog work, and then he sort of ruffled it up with this gel, and then it become natural curls. And I was like, my fucking hair does this all the time with product, all the fucking time. So I thought I fucking try it. I've already tried this out, and it fucking works. Uh, this is the L'Oreal Paris New Studio Mad Messy product. It is a shine free spun. I'm all into natural because if you look at me, I'm fucking natural, bitch. Natural is me middle name. I keep doing these weird accents. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing it for. Yeah, and it's at level four in the cr the cart pull right, the chart on it or in naturalness. And it's a messy matte because people like this sort of beach textured feel to your hair. Use just the top of it and look, it is a sponge. <laughs> ah, no, falling out. No, no, it's not falling out. It's not falling out. It's a motherfucking sponge, and I just want to put my finger into it. Uh, your finger. What am I doing? Sorry. Like, let's get back to the video. So on the advert, the guy had straight hair like this. He was posing around, like he was doing all this posing around. Then he just grabbed a bit and he just filed it in his hair, and it became a nice curl hair. So let's do it. <laughs> So it went something like that. Uh, I would use a little bit more, which physically is sponge basically, and it comes out quite evenly nice on the hands, like really white, pasty, and I feel like the texture is really good. Like you can tell it's gonna last a long time. Like on the other, he just sort of scrunched around. Oh my god, how come I don't have this gel? And then I thought, well. I'm gonna go buy it. Yeah, I would use this, like this, and then I would maybe add a tiny bit of hairspray. So, what do you think? I think it's fucking done exactly my old sort of haggis sort of hairstyle. Very seen, like, you could get away with a seen sort of hair. Like, scrunch it in, scrunch it around. The one in the video he went for was more of a, it was downwards, like curls like this. Like, a natural sort of, sort of hair, like. So, I would... To get a model sort of hair, it's really like, it's nothing seen or anything. That was more seen than the hair I did first. So I would get it fully in my hair and bring it back. So you could bring it all back and it, f it works really easily. And you don't need to really add any more of the product in now because I would say that would be too much product. To get the modeling sort of curls, I would bring parts forward now after that sort of style I want it to be flat but curly so it's not got any much volume it's just curls and looking too straight for this I'm sorry hair is too straight I'm gonna add a little bit more in there is a sort of natural natula sort of look like less seen more like you could do a little parting sort of more modelly like it's more natural sort of guy because most guys wouldn't go for a seen look they would go for more texturized sort of gum hair you're probably like i'm gonna turn him off now don't do that please i normally go for this this is my signature look grandma afro like sort of weird hair i do it's like an old hag slash afro like you look at that at the back now that is some motherfucking curls curls oh my god i'm a hag hag on youtube on acid <laughs> oh my god i love being a hag on tron i love l'oreal paris you fucking retard bitch <laughs> To create the rest of the highness of this hair, you've got to get a brush just like this and just sort of file it up 
like this and you can fix it all together with a bit of hairspray just to sort of set it all into place. Old haggisy curls, you know, so yeah, I do this hair seven times from time to time. The effect or curls, whatever, whatever you're into. Like if you're into curls, you would scrunch it. If you're into matte look, you would rub it down. <laughs>